I'm here to walk you through the room selection process. You will receive an email with your room selection time slot. Your time slot is based on your UK admissions track and your housing application completion date. During room selection, you'll notice an additional tab in your housing application called room selection. If you do have a roommate in mind, make sure you have created a roommate group with your preferred roommates. You'll also need to make sure that the group is verified by the group leader in the roommate request section of your application before starting the room selection process. You can look for roommates by searching their personal details, like their first and last name. Once you have found your roommate, select add to group. Again, the group leader must verify the roommate group to pull each other into vacant spaces. As a reminder, it is not necessary for you to have a roommate to participate in room selection. Once you're ready to select your room, you'll need to select the room selection tab to view available residence halls. After reviewing the information about available halls, click on the residence hall where you want to live. If you select a four person suite and want more than one roommate, you will need to add two suites to your cart because four person suites are grouped by two students to a unit. Use the floors filter on the left hand side of your screen to see which rooms make up each four person suite. Please remember that if you accepted an offer to a living learning program or LLP, you would only see the building where your LLP is located. Depending on which building you choose, you will see either a list of floors or a list of suites. Select either the floor or suite that you are interested in. Next, you will select your bed space. Depending on the room type, beds are labeled A through D. These letters indicate the bed space location, starting from the left side of the room and working through the alphabet as you move to the right side of the room. If you do not declare a gender on your UK application, your gender will be listed as unknown. In the room selection process, once you select a room and bed space, you have the option to pull in any roommates that are in your roommate group. The roommate with the earliest time slot can select for the entire group. As a reminder, if you need to add more than one roommate to a four person suite, you will need to add two suites to your cart. Keep in mind, you will only have 10 minutes once you select a room to reserve it and pull in any confirmed roommates. When you're all done, be sure to click continue. Once you've completed these steps, you'll see all of your room and roommate information listed under the application summary tab on the application. You will also receive a booking confirmation email. Once you've completed room selection, and if you are content with your selected bed space, you're all set. But if you want to change rooms or buildings after you've made a selection, you're welcome to do so. You can make this change through a function called room swap. Room selection time slots will remain open from your designated start time until 11.59 p.m. on the last day of the room swap window. Room swap lets you change your building and or room by allowing you to see what other buildings and rooms are available so you can move yourself into a new space. Some important reminders. If you are in a living learning program, you will only see bed spaces within that LLP. You will only have 10 minutes once you select a room to reserve it and pull in any confirmed roommates. If you have a roommate and your group wishes to stay together but select a different unit, your roommate group leader is the only student allowed to change the entire group's assignments. If you choose to no longer be part of the roommate group, you may change or swap your own space. If your roommate's information does not appear on the application summary page, it means your roommate marked their information as private. You may contact the campus housing office and they will be able to provide you the student's name and UK email address. If you select a new bed space through room swap, your original bed space will be canceled. You can go through room swap again to see if you can get back into your previous bed space but there's no guarantee it will still be available. Remember, room selection is based on room availability. Room selection time slots will remain open from your designated start time until 11.59 p.m. on the last day of the room selection window.
If you have any questions about your application or room selection, contact the Campus Housing Office via email or phone. We can't wait for you to be a part of the Big Blue family.